Hey guys, thanks for tuning in. Today I'll be going over the banker's algorithm and I'll be explaining basically uh, how you find the need um, and then how you further work through it and figure out a safe sequence. So let's get started. Here's what I have prepared for us. Um, have a little allocation matrix, uh, max matrix, and the current available. So step one, um, it's important to know that uh, max minus allocation equals need. This is how we're going to generate our need matrix. So there's going to be a little bit of uh, linear algebra going on here, but don't worry, it's nothing too serious. And if you haven't had um, linear algebra, it won't take any time at all to really pick up on what's going on here. So, first of all, we're going to go ahead and set this up and swap the max and allocate so that way it's more intuitive when we're doing the subtraction. And we're going to go ahead and grab the 0, 0, 1, 2, and we're going to subtract 0, 0, 1, 2 from it. Now, you basically go from left to right or right to left really and just you're really doing the arithmetic on the numbers in the same position really so this is going to end up being zero 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 and that's going to go ahead and get filled in right there And then we're going to go ahead and grab the next one, which is going to be 1750. And we're going to subtract 1000 zero, zero, zero from it. So the only real arithmetic, arithmetic excuse me, that occurs here is uh, you're subtracting 1 from 1. Um, so we're going to end up with 0750. Zero, and we're going to go ahead and fill that in up here. Next, we're going to go ahead and grab uh, 2, 3, 5, 6. And we're going to subtract 1, 3, 5, 4 from it. And we're going to end up with 1, 0, 0, 2. All right. And we're going to go ahead and grab the next one. Let's see here, that's 0654. I'm sorry, that's 0652. And we're subtracting 0632 from it. And we're going to end up with uh, 0020. And I'm going to go ahead and do this one a little quicker, but not too fast. So, in case you're trying to keep up with me, it's not going too fast for you. So, I went ahead and grabbed 0656 which is P4 of the max matrix and we're going to subtract 0014 which is P4 of the allocation matrix and we end up with 0642 all right now step two we will be determining the safe sequence so let's start First, we have to go ahead and uh, test our available uh, versus our current needs. So, well, we start with P0, and that's going to be 0, 0, 0, 0 is greater, uh, sorry, that's 0, 0, 0, 0 is less than or equal to 1, 5, 2, 0. So, we will need to know that available plus allocation equals new available. So I'm going to go ahead and just put that up here in the top. So now, if uh, this condition is in fact true, so if 0, 0, 0, 0, less than equal to one five two zero 
then we go ahead and perform this uh, arithmetic here so it's uh, true so we're gonna go ahead and put that up there and we're gonna go ahead and move it the available matrix right there to match up our formula up top so then we're gonna grab 0, 0, 1, 2 from the allocation matrix and we're gonna get our new available now we're gonna take that new available and compare it to P1 to see if we can uh, go ahead and allocate the resources that P1 requires so as you can see that that is in fact false so that will not be uh, allocated so what we're gonna do is we're just gonna skip P1 and we're gonna go right into P2 and when we compare uh, 1532 with uh, 1002 we can obviously accommodate that so we're gonna go ahead and repeat what we did with P0 so we move the available which is 1532 down below and we add 1354 which is P2 from the allocation to it in order to get our new available so here we are so next we're gonna go ahead and take our new available and compare it to P3 so if 0 0 2 0 less than equal to 2 8 8 6 which is true then we go ahead and repeat this process again so what we're gonna go ahead and do is move 2 8 8 6 down here again and we're gonna go ahead and grab 0632 from uh, P3 of the allocation matrix and we're gonna add the two and that gives us 2 14 11 8 and that is our current new available then we're gonna go ahead and repeat the step again so we're gonna take 2 14 uh, 11 8 and we're gonna move it up here and we're gonna see if 0642 less than equal to 214 11 8 and that also evaluates to true so we're gonna go ahead and repeat our step again by moving 214 11 8 back down here and we're gonna go ahead and grab 0, 0, 1, 4 from the allocation matrix P4 and we're gonna add the two and that will give us 2 14 12 12 and, and now that is our new available so now we're gonna take that new available and we're gonna go back to P1 and see if we are now able to accommodate uh, that request so I went ahead and moved that up here and it's highlighted so you can see it more easily so now if 0750 less than equal to 214 12 12 which is obviously true uh, we can go ahead and accommodate that request so we go ahead and do that and there we have it so that is actually going to be the safe sequence and it's going to be exactly in the order we went so that means it's going to be P0 is the first one then P2 then P3 P4 and then P1 and there you have it that is the safe sequence so hopefully that made sense and you were able to easily follow along and thanks a lot for watching um, I really do hope you enjoyed it